Hi, I'm Patrick Axtell. I am the Bitta teacher here at uh, Bray Linda High School. Been here for five years. Uh, I'm a general contractor by trade. I sell a business. Been doing that for about 30 years. Had a great time. I did teach down at the junior high for a couple years, but uh, most of the time up here. We've got a fantastic facility I'd love to show you. This is a great classroom. Uh, this is where we all start. You'll notice the computers on the tables, those are all brand new. We teach our students CAD, Computer Assisted Drawing, which they can use in the workforce. This whole thing about BIDA, BIDA is Building Industry Technology Academy. Love to have your students come check it out. They don't have to have any experience. I will train them from A to Z. Uh, there's four years that's involved in BIDA. First year, they're gonna learn tools. Hand tools, how to use safety. Always safety doesn't take a holiday as you can see up here. So I really, really push that. They have to have closed toed shoes. They have to have glasses on, bare minimum to go into our shop. But this is where everything starts. This is kind of our um, office, if you will. And I show them how to do, uh, like I said, drawings and plans and how to bid things. And um, really just like we would do out in the real world on a construction site. Let me show you our shop though. This is really an incredible three, three what is it? 3,300 square foot shop. Phenomenal, we got A to Z tools. Come on, let me show you. So you can see the plethora of tools. If you can hand over here. This is phenomenal, we need it because we've got about 30 students per class. I teach about six classes here. Um, zero period through five. And you can see some of these big cabinets that we're making right here. This actually is in-house and it is for our band department for their instruments. Um, I want the students uh, in Beta 3-4 to take control and to actually uh, build and supply the um, teacher's needs as they, as they come up. Uh, and like I said, uh, Beta 1 is hand tools. We're learning how to use these brand new saws, these minor saws over here. We're constantly getting new, new state-of-the-art tools. Look at this brand new CNC machine just out of the package. We're gonna get that rolling in another month or so, so they can actually go from computer to design to this actually cuts out the parts. Phenomenal, this is exactly what we do in industry. Big table saw, this is a safety table saw, it's called a saw stop, <coughs> excuse me. It, um, I wouldn't recommend it, but heaven forbid a student gets his finger stuck in here, which he will never do because we have all the safety precautions. This will stop faster than your, uh, your car will stop um, if you got in an accident with the airbags. Another minor saw over here. Here we have miniature lathes, and we do all kinds of fun tools. We do um, pencils and pens. We turn them and uh, make a custom pen. Here we've got our fan saws. So a bit of one to learn fan saws. We have our disc sanders, our small disc sander, all the kind of tools you can ever imagine and plenty of room so the students can uh, join with their group. We do team building, so they learn how to do team building skills. They learn how to build, they learn how to um, measure. Measuring is number one. If you can't measure, you can't build. And we have a great time in here. Uh, this is a bit of one. Look at these cool houses. We do it's a tiny house, but this structure shows all the different intricacies of framing. This one up here is a two-story house all done by our females. We've got about 20 to 25 girls in the program. They do a phenomenal job. Love to have the girls here. So you can see we have state-of-the-art equipment, uh, anything that they need, just like in industry. Next, I want to show you what we do on the outside in a, what we call the playpen. Come on. So this is what we call our playpen, and it's just that. Sheds and big structures and really learn how to do framing. We have a competition each year in April called uh, the Design Built Competition. Us and about 25 other schools go head to head at uh, Reliable Lumber over here in Huntington Beach. They open up the whole lumber yard. It's all free. They donate all the plywoods and everything. But here's where we practice. We can practice roofs. We practice framing, electrical, plumbing, how to build a set of stairs. So at the end of four years, they can actually go out and get a job. And this is all produced by North Orange County ROP, 
is uh, kind of the driving force behind this. And the reason we've been here, it has been a part of this program for, oh gosh, probably 15 years at least. And so we just thoroughly enjoy being here. We'd love to have you come, be a part of it. I will train you. We have a great time. Uh, the kids love to do demo. They love to use their hands. And uh, once again, safety doesn't take a holiday. So they will come back with all their fingers. Have a great day and thank you so much.